Hello everyone. In this video, we will see what are drill down reports and how can we create them in ServiceNow. First of all, what are drill down reports? Drilling down means to click on a report section to see a subset of that reports data in a new report. Drill down reports can be different report type, but their parent must be the same table or same data source. The last level in a drill down is always a list report. What that means if you click on a report with some data on that, it should drill down further based on that filter. And if you want further drill downs, you can have them as well. But at the last level of drill down, it is always a list report. So this is how it looks like. For example, we have a bar chart. Then we click on one of these bars. It will be redirected to this report, which is further drilled down into count. And if I click on any of these bars again, it will further drill down into this list report. So this is the final drill down in this report. We will quickly see that in service. Now, how can we create these drill downs? Also, we need drill down reports for filtering data so that the user can see only the essential data what he wants and not the whole subset of that data. And then this is the use case which we will be working on. We will be creating a report on incident table which would be first of all grouped by category and then when we further click on category it should show another report which is grouped by state. So this is our first level of drill down and then second level of drill down would be grouped by assignment group. It will show next report which will be based on the assignment group. Now for example if the report is grouped by category and I click on the category called inquiry it will show me a report which has category of inquiry and which would be further grouped by state and for example it shows different states like new closed or in progress and then we will click on one of the state for example on new state it will again show me a report which is grouped by assignment group and then if we further click on that assignment group it should show me finally a list of all the incidents in the list view if you are not aware of how to create a report in service now please click on the top right corner now we will go to service now and see how can we create these reports and drill downs i am in service now and i went into the report section and clicked on create new to create a new report and i can say incident report drill down demo so this is the name of the report which we can keep as we wish and then we will select the table as source type and then the table name which will be the incident table and I'll click on this and I'll click on next And just to get some space, I will remove this pin from here. And now we will select the type of report. For example, we will select bars. And the report will show in a bar. And then we have to create a group by. And first group by will be based on category. So I'll click on this drop down and I'll select the category field. And I will click on next. And now we can see all the categories which are present on this incident table like inquiry help software hardware network if you want to change color we can say use color palette and then again save the report now it will show report in different color and now we want to create a drill down when somebody clicks on any of these bars he should be redirected to a report or a drill down where it should show a report which is grouped by states and it should have the category as inquiry help. For that, I'll go up and I'll click on this icon. And here we can see add drill down. I'll go ahead and click on this. And it will ask the drill down name. And I can say group by state. And now the table name is selected as incident and it is read only field. If you remember in the first slide, I had shown the drill down should be on the same table. I'll click on next and again I can choose a different type of report. For example, this time I will choose a pie chart. 
and then I will click on next and then I have to say on which particular field I want to have that group by and I'll select state and I'll click on next and I will save this drill down now I will be redirected back to the parent report and here we can see there is one drill down created on this report structure I'll click here and I can see this is the first level of drill down and I'll go ahead and create a second level of this drill down which is based on assignment group I'll click here on add drill down then I will give the drill down name as group by assignment group and again the table name is selected as incident I'll click on next and then I can select the report type as horizontal bar for example and after this I'll click on next and I'll click on group by and I'll select assignment group and then I'll click on next and use color palette and I will save this drill down as well and it will redirect me back to the parent report and I can see here there are two drill downs created for this report the first one is group by state and the second one is group by assignment group now I will add this report to an existing dashboard which I had already created for this demo if you are not aware how can we create dashboards and use them in ServiceNow please click on the top right corner and you will be redirected to a video let's quickly go to my dashboard which I had already created called drill down report dashboard I'll click on add widgets I'll click on reports and I'll add this report which is here and I'll click on add and now this report is showing on my dashboard and it has an all the incidents which are in service now and they are grouped by category for example there are 38 incidents which have category as inquiry help and next th there are 13 incidents which have category as software and so on and now if I click on one of the categories it will further drill down into a bar chart report or a drill down which shows me all the incidents which have category as inquiry help grouped by their states for example there are 12 incidents which have category as inquiry help and they are in new state similarly there are six incidents which have category as inquiry help and their state is in progress and now for example if I click on in progress where I want to see all the incidents which are of category inquiry help and have state as in progress all those will show me grouped by their assignment group so this is the second drill down there are two incidents which don't have any assignment group there are two incidents which have service desk as their assignment group and two incidents which have software as their assignment group and now if I further click on any of these assignment groups it should show me a list of incidents of that assignment group as software for example and it should have the category as inquiry help and it should be in the state of in progress I'll click on software and now we can see the state is in progress and the category is inquiry help so this is how you can create drill downs for your report alternatively if you want to refresh everything on the dashboard itself there is an alternative which we can use which are interactive filters I have made a separate video on that if you want to know more about interactive filters and I mostly use interactive filter for my clients but if there is a requirement for drill down of course you can use drill downs as well I hope this video was helpful to you and you learned something new if you have any questions please do let me know in comments thank you for watching this video and please subscribe to my channel